I'd like to discuss now how we can increase the magnification in an image uh, without changing the objective. This system has in front of each of its two cameras a magnification lens, which by default is set to 1x, but which can be increased to 1.5x. So let's see how to do that and what the consequences of doing that are. What I have on right now as a sample is something stained with phalloidin, and we're looking at it with the Xyla camera. Uh, that's the camera with the smaller pixels uh, with a 63x oil objective. So if we go to live, we can see this is what it looks like, and that's what I had snapped a picture of uh, just a moment ago. Now we can increase the magnification in this image by going down here. You can see there's a section in the global settings inside the channel manager in the channel uh, uh, section. Um, which has camera magnification, it has an arrow pointing up, and camera magnification has an arrow pointing sideways. These are the places where we can increase the magnification lens on the way to one or the other camera. So the thing to uh, keep in mind is that the one that says camera magnification up, that corresponds to the Xyla. So if I change that from 1 to 1.5x, you'll see uh, it makes a little bit of noise because there's something mechanical that needs to change. And if I now go to live, I will get an image with a higher magnification. So the pixel size will be smaller. I'll be able to see more details. The field of view will be smaller. Uh, and my signal to noise will be smaller as well. So let's see if I go to live. You can see that all those things are true. We have a smaller field of view, a, a smaller pixel size. So we're able to discern a little bit more detail. And the image looks noisier because there's um, less light going to each pixel because the, the light from the sample is spread out uh, more. So that is how you change the magnification for the Xyla. If you wanted to do something similar for the Ixon, instead of using this lens, you need to use this one because in the nomenclature of this microscope, camera magnification, this arrow pointing to the side, that refers to the far camera, which on this one is the Ixon EMCCD. Um, the combination of the different objectives and the different magnifications give many different options for pixel sizes. Uh, and those options are in this document, which lives on the desktop of this uh, computer. So you can see you can really select uh, quite a variety of pixel sizes. And if you add binning, layer on binning onto this, which is this setting where you can group together pixels, uh, there's another layer of complexity in terms of what those pixel sizes can be.